Let's talk about Houston and, and Utah. How about that? Houston off a bad loss, uh, Utah off of a big offensive win. What do we expect here? And how, just one thing, mm-hmm. Troy Vesas, how about Wiz without Wall? Chat nailed yeah. it. Oh, played much great better call. Without great Wall. calls. Great and, calls. And that started when I moved past that game mm-hmm. and Dan Kelly said, I wish you could see what I'm seeing right now. Wizards minus four. And then it just, yeah. like, uh, the light went off. Of course. Of course. We went through this last year. Yes. Shout out to everybody. That's just us working on it as a team and smashing and putting money in our pockets. Suns Blazers, is that what we're on? Yes. Uh, well, no, I, whatever you want to talk about. There's only two other games. Oh, Rocket Let's Jazz. Let's yeah, talk yeah, Rocket yeah. Jazz. That's the big one. Utah beat the Spurs 139-105 on Tuesday. Franchise record 23s, 60.6% from long range, 60.7% from the field. It's, it's not quite to the same situation as we have in the NHL with the Flames, but what do we expect? Can they possibly put that up again? Seven Utah players scored in double figures. Mitchell's 20 points. 12 of 13 Jazz players shot 50% or better. Mitchell's been very good since he came back from that rib contusion, averaging 24.3 points per game over the last four, shot better than 50% in three of those games. Now, what the hell do we do with the Rockets? Mm-hmm. One, they've lost, sorry, they've won there. They've lost five of seven. Or no, no, yeah, what the hell? That feels wrong that they, I say they've won five. They've lost five of seven, right? They, but I, I, that feels like I made a mistake there. Houston has allowed 116.1 points per game over its last nine. They're now 25th in the NBA defensively. We talked about that when we were coming in, like who's going to play defense on this team. They're coming off that loss to Minnesota that made no sense. 29 points after halftime. I had already counted that as a victory. This is a second meeting between these two teams this season. Both teams are healthy. I'll tell you what. Yeah. I mean, I, you're talking about the Rockets, right? Yeah, yeah, not only have they been losing, but their only wins have come against uh, the dumpster fire teams, the Bulls and the Spurs. Seven, yeah. right. and, uh, and, and, and the only wins came against dumpster fire teams, Chicago and San Antonio. Yeah, I'll tell you what. <laughs> I've been staying as much as I can away from totals in NBA unless mm-hmm. I see something very early in the morning. But you'd be liking thinking. under here. Well, I'm just saying that I've also got to, the only way I'm going to keep this record going is if I just do what works for me. And sure. the Jazz have confounded me all year. I'm just not going to. I don't know what the hell they're going to do from game to game. I am off this Rockets Jazz. I want to get to 20 units and then I want to get to 30 units and 40 and 50. And the Jazz are losing and losing and losing with them. I don't know what they're going to do. I don't know what the hell the Rockets are going to do. 29 points, second half. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to our channel. Now we've put a lot of work into producing all these free videos. So please help us out and keep all our content free for you forever by simply liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. Now, not to mention a visit to our industry-leading website will warm the hearts of all our SBR employees, especially myself. Now, the links are over there to the left, uh, so do check those out. Thanks for watching.